listen and practice. This month must have her been like November to December. The sky was clean. We were enjoying the sun with our friends in college ground. Today we playing football match. Suddenly I see towards the main gate of the college. Anyone was coming, wearing a green color jacket, a blue jeans, and her hair was shining. The sunlight was falling on her hair, and see looking very gorgeous. She came near us, my eyes was wide open. Hey, this is Ankita. I know her, she was my classmate. I was calling Ankita many times, but she couldn't not be able to listen me. In school time I had proposed, but till now she had never refused, and never agree only just smile. She just smile and go in classroom. My all friends say that she also loves you. So that's why she doesn't deny you. Seeing her so well dressed, I also decided that I will keep taking answers from her. Now we all had gone in classroom. But as soon as we got a chance in lunch break, I asked her, Ankita. I want to ask something, ask, said Ankita. I was speaking while suppressing my voice, she said cutting my words, okay, today you will silent, I will speak only. On hearing this word, my heartbeat started loudly. The complete body was shock. I was very happy to heard that. Today was most beautiful moment of my life. I was waiting for many months of this moment. She had accepted my love. And we both hugging each other. After that I seemed all direction was filled with color of love. Now we had become famous in the whole college like Layla Majna. Our all friends called her as sister-in-law. After that we both enjoy together many times. Sometimes we going to see movie. Every evening we both to go in park near us college. Everyone looking towards us. But there came a time when our college was coming was end. Both of us were afraid of separation. Different. Many thoughts were coming in our mind. Sometimes we think we both get married, and sometimes we start to fear the decision of our family. When our college was over, we both came back at our home, but her memories made it difficult to live. For many days, I did not doing anything, just thinking about her. I saw to look at his pictures in sadness. I was eldest among my brother sisters, due to which responsibilities are made after study, that I want a job as soon as possible. I started trying to forget everything slowly slowly. After some days, I got a job offer from a company. In so many days Ankita must have forgotten me. But I think that when I could not forget her then how could she have forgotten me? I wanted to forget everything, and go to her, but the responsibilities was attached me. I went to the job interview. I had no interest in this job but still went for the job. Now I had reached the office for interview. Many people were sitting in the office for interview. I also waiting for my turn. Her memories were coming there too and a different kind of seclusion was being killed. I was sitting with many people but I was feeling alone. After some time it was my turn too. Sir, you are being called in for an interview. 
an employee of that company came to me and said, saying, okay. I went inside by pushing the door of the office. A man with big eyes, a rough face, a stern question on his face. He was sitting on the chair he say for me to sit, after he asked, what is the name? Yes, Ankit Sharma, I said. After that he asked many questions, to which I answering with confidence. He also asked some strange questions. But I have answered all the questions right. Do you love anyone? I was shocked to hear his question. Who asks as a question for a good job? I thought it in my mind to answer this question in silence. It seemed like it was less a job interview, and more a marriage interview. I like you very much, he said called anyone by pressing the ring bell button with his left hand. Take them, and go to madam's cabin, he said to the man after coming. I went the man to the other cabin. I was thinking, we get a job or we'll have to return like this. If you will get job then good otherwise. When I went inside the second cabin, only then I heard the voice, Sir, tell me how much salary will you? When I sit on chair and saw Ankita, my eyes were kept open. The whole body was like lightning. Ankita was sitting there with a slight smile on her face. Seeing Ankita, I kept looking stunned when she said to me, Why sir went to Chowk? I said, Ankita, you? Why did you think we forgot you? I also miss you as much as you too. Then we both hugged each other. For few moments, somewhere we lost in different world. It seemed that a bankrupt person had got his entire property back again. Ankita told me that the company belongs to her father, and Ankita herself had offered me a job by speaking. Because Ankita he talked to her father about me, and her father want to meet me. Now that both of us had met, after that both of us met, after that both of us were married with the agree of our family. Both of us are together today by giving a promise to be together till birth. I was very happy that I have found my first love and pray to God that I may get the same loving Ankita in my next life as well. I don't want these stars. I don't want these springs. You were always with me. This is the desire of your crazy people.